So if you look on the bottom here, you can see how there's this circle there in the middle. So essentially you take this, you set it on here, and then it kind of just slides back and will clip into place. Bam. Oh yeah, we're back with another bird feeder. Special thanks to our friends at this company who were nice enough to send us their full HD smart bird feeder camera. Of course, we're gonna get on the overhead rig and go through the unboxing of this. Then I'm gonna set it up outside and try to get some audio video clips of birds actually landing on this bird feeder. So click like, click subscribe, indulge in your life at indulgeclothing.com for the merch. And let's check out this smart bird feeder. All right, so here we are with our BirdFi feeder, full HD smart bird feeder cam. Just the uh, sticker and company logo at the top. A little bit of information here on the side about the AI bird recognition. So uh, it can recognize over 6,000 species of birds. So when they land on your bird feeder, it'll record the images and everything and also tell you what bird it was. Same picture here as there, other than it being a different bird. And then here's some of the uh, features. It's where you can download the app, live video, full color night vision, 1.5 liter seed reservoir, motion detection, two way audio, 135 degree wide angle view, IP65 weatherproof, and it supports a micro SD card. So you can see here on the bottom, we have the uh, NI-8102. Let's open it up, take a look at it. All right, we got our, it's a little stand for the birds to land on. We got a very nice quick start guide. And even a template where you know where to drill your holes. And then, oh, lots of more stuff. Let's uh, do this. There we go. That's it for the box. So, where do we start? Interesting. This is the mount. It's actually a like metal titanium mount. Very nice. Some uh, included Velcro. This is the top of the bird feeder. Hardboard. A few of uh, these on here as well to help. And some stuff crammed down in here. And all this. All right, so here's the actual bird feeder. This part will pop onto here, and this lid will be able to go on, and then it mounts down here. Now here's the camera. Up here on the top is a uh, power button, a reset button, micro SD card, and then in this, solar light. So this is a little included uh, solar panel for it. All right, this is of course screws and a charging cable. I think we have uh, everything kind of laid out here. I'm gonna get this put together. I'm not gonna bore you with it. We'll show it all put together. Then we'll mount it and we'll show you some footage from this bird feeder. All right, popped on our top. It just kind of slides down in these grooves and then it's able to clip back. Now I still need to put the front on, but I realized it would probably be a lot easier to connect this camera to Wi-Fi from inside my room. So, well, that's what we're going to do. Charged it up. Charge port here on the back with a USB type C cable. Nice little wireless antenna. And so we're going to come in here. I have even popped in a micro SD card. And so we'll hold our power button here for a moment. There we go. We got a blue, blue light. Now let's get their app. It's right here on the box. So this is the app here. We will we will install the app, create us an account, sign in, and then come back for the setup. All right, now that we're signed into our app, we can try to add this camera. So with it making that noise and the blue flashing light, it should be ready to pair. We'll click our plus sign here. It asks us where we have BirdFi, doorbells, indoor cameras, outdoor cameras, etc. So we got the BirdFi, we got the feeder, add new camera. All right, I heard the sound or saw the light next. I heard the beeping sound next while using the app. I'll put in my Wi-Fi password, and now I'll scan this QR code with the bird feeder. Nice and instant. So it says it'll automatically redirect, so. Connection succeeded. Perfect. So now it's going through its process to add the bird feeder. Connection successful. Click next. Call it the bird camera. Done. Upgrade in process. And now it is running an update. So we'll let this update run, and then I'll show you through a bit of the app, and then we'll put this outside and show you how it looks. While that's still going, I'm gonna go ahead and pop this little guy on. There we go. Take our little screw, screw it into place. There we go, now that's on and it's closer to mounting. 
All right, 100%. Now they do include a free trial. Here is the app. So there's our camera. If we select on it, it brings up our bird feeder camera. Now along the top here, you can see the name as well as the battery. And then if you click this button, it takes you into the settings where you get a little more information about the Wi-Fi signal, the status, location, etc. Motion detection, that is on. Sleep settings. So this is your saved SD video. This is your motion detection settings. This here is just your camera settings. So you could change the name, the location, etc. Then down here we have sleep settings. This is where you could schedule it to sleep. So like maybe at nighttime you don't want it on because there's no birds out, you could have it off. Down here is the lighting settings. So you can turn off this indicator light and then the night vision settings. Audio settings, got the volume all the way. And what is more? Motion alert, cool down time, okay. And then advanced anti-flickers enabled and installation settings. That's just however you install it. So you can rotate the image if needed. Other than that, you have a sound button here. So that, that enables the sound so you can hear it from your phone. You can press this button to talk to this bird. If you did that, you might would scare the bird away, but hey. There's also a white light. That can be good for scaring off squirrels who are trying to take the food. And other than that, there is an alarm. Now, if you turn this sideways, you click this little button and you get a full screen view. You can see, you can take a photo with this one. Like that, just took a picture. And then if I click this top button, it would start a recording. So I'll actually do an inside recording. There we go. And then we come back here, we click our stop and the video was saved. In terms of the app, that is really about it. Let's take our screws and our mount and our camera and go put this outside. So we're gonna mount this one right here on this corner. So essentially you take your mount with this part upward and mount it like this. And then the bird feeder is able to slide right on this little circle. I'll show you in a moment once I have this mounted. Screws are in and slide on, tighten the screws up. Now we're ready to slide on the bird feeder. So if you look on the bottom here, you can see how there's this circle there in the middle. So essentially you take this and you set it on here like so, and then it kind of just slides back and will clip into place, bam. And then you're able to easily release it from here. And so there we go. That is our bird feeder all installed, ready to go. Now I have not ran the solar panel yet, but it has a full battery for demonstration purposes. I'm not gonna worry with the solar panel right now, but I will pop the back up. I love that. And we'll pour in some bird seed. All right, we're gonna pour in our bird seed now. All right, now clipped. Got our Wi-Fi antenna angled towards our house. There we go. Our little bird feeder is all set up and ready to go. I think that will do it for this video. All right, and that'll do it for our NetView bird feeder. I've set up a few of these, and honestly, this is one of two that has had a very, very good app. The app for this one was nice and smooth. It instantly worked. It instantly added to my Wi-Fi and did everything that it should do. And I love that this one does offer the SD card support as, as well as the cloud service. Outside of that, this one has a pretty large capacity to feed the birds with the bird seed, and you're able to have a very nice full HD camera to capture these birds, see what they look like, get notified of which one landed on your bird feeder. Really, really cool for somebody who loves birds. So I'll, of course, have this exact bird feeder linked down below in my description if you'd like to grab one for yourself, and that should do it for today's video. Click like, click subscribe, indulge in your life at indulgeclothing.com for the merch. We'll see you in the next one. Deuces.